Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here we have started with the modeling of this elephant animal over here. So let's continue it. So now what I'll be doing over here is like I'll just go over here onto this side. So if you look at this, this part and this part are going to come out over here so we can slightly just shuffle this part a bit out let's put a loop over here select this and slightly just drag it inside drag it over here in this way so I'll get some space or you can say a place over here so I'll just select this area so that's a good stuff now so I can just adjust this over here in this way I'll just push this over here so I'll select this part so I'll go here and slightly I'll just insert it and I'll slightly extrude it a bit inside over here and now I'll go to the side view over here and I'll just take a line or else you can just take a cylinder over here So let's just take a cylinder part over here if you want you can just use a cylinder and I can slightly just rotate this in 90 degree over here. Let's go over here reduce the radius convert to editable poly select this. I'll slightly scale it, I'll just push it over here, I'll select this polygons, let's extrude it over here, let's rotate it, even you can use a line and you can adjust this, if you want to use a line you can do that also, I think that would be much uh, better if you want, you can utilize it or else whatever you feel that is ok you can go with that so I will just adjust this in this way again extrude it keep on extruding it I will slightly scale it again I will extrude it again I will slightly rotate it I will scale this We'll definitely push it later on to one side over here so that would be much much better so again I'll select this and let's extrude it again slightly scale this I'll push it over here select this and let's put one edge loop over here and this way. So once you have done this, so I can just select this part and let's slightly shuffle it over here. So let's just push it inside this and make it uh, smooth, a bit more smoother. So select the vertices, so let's just select the vertices and slightly you can adjust it more inside over here, just save your file once again over here. Now after that
if you see over here uh, let's go to the back part and slightly I can uh, rotate it so it's not always necessary that it should go straight over here you can slightly tilt and rotate it over here in this way okay much better now let's go to the back side and let's select the area where you want to go with the tail part if you want I can just put one uh, loop over here for this part over here select this select the polygon select the polygon over here and if you want we can also put one loop this way so we can add some loops if required so I can just insert this let's insert it I'll slightly just scale this over here select this polygons and I'll just delete it right away so select this and this drag it make it straighter select this polygons and slightly extrude it down I can just rotate it so if you look at this part let's select this and slightly I'll shuffle this over here slightly I'll shuffle it in this way again extrude it down drag it down again so we need to definitely tweak this edges tweak the vertices to make it look proper so if you want you can slightly adjust this whole thing that we can do it over here select this polygons again again extrude it down just drag it select the vertices and slightly just adjust it inside and if you want you can just use the nerve toggle to see how it looks like So I'll just come out of it, I'll select this whole thing and I can just make it more straighter, slightly rotated. So select this polygons over here for this tail part, I can just delete that. So we can just delete that polygons for the tail. select this drag it a bit out you can just drag these elements make it look more of a 
round shape all right adjust it correctly let's see where we can tweak the edges i think looks much better okay looks good slightly you can select this push it up drag it out drag this out okay so we can definitely adjust this all the elements correctly over here so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so we'll continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial